Hey guys, I'm LB, and we are going to check out Push Alternate by Quaternary. This was suggested to me by Rectorox, as explained right here. Apparently, communicable diseases can be transmitted through test chambers. Rectorox had a cold when making Push. I played it, and now I have a cold. Please remember to wash every surface in your chamber with soap and water before you publish. Thanks. Anyway, this is a slightly altered version of Rectorox Push, because nobody can avoid remaking his maps. It's so much fun to do. Hmm, I should probably pick a map of his to remake. Alright, let's get going, and hopefully we don't get sick. This is quite a bit different from the original. Okay, we got a light bridge this time, that's- that's a thing. Hmm, I feel like we're gonna have to suspend the cube in a similar manner, but without the funnel and using the light bridge instead. That... goes to... What exactly? Goes to this... Which leads to yet more! Oh, wow. Okay, first of all, what's up here? Oh, this goes to the same place, huh? Oh, but you know what, I bet that platform goes all the way up there. We get this, right? Ooh. So we cannot store the cube here unless we place it here initially. Once the cube leaves, it cannot come back. Let's see. Okay, well, first of all, I'm not entirely clear on the concept of what this whole area is for, but I'm assuming it's for pushing the cube around at some point. That's how we'd recall the cube. If in in order to recall the cube, we have to lose our portals. That's clever. That basically resets the entire puzzle right there. Alright, so what's the best way... Oh, you know what? I can get that light bridge out right now. Don't know what I'm doing. Oh, come on. Okay, let's get down here. There we go, now we have a light bridge, but... <laughs> hmm. I probably should have figured out what I was gonna do with it. Yeah, that's not too useful. <laughs> and there's no way to turn that off, we can only reverse it. As far as I know. So we can't go back through that portal ever. And even when it's reversed, you can't go back through it because it clears your portals. Does anything disable this fizzler? Because it does not seem like it. Seems to be the answer is no. We could get the cube in here, but then we'd be indefinitely trapped. What's the point of walking all the way up here? Just decoration? I guess so we could see that surface. Why would we want to see that? Oh, So if we come out onto the light bridge and walk up here, we could switch out the light bridge for a funnel. But I don't yet know when to do that. Let's try doing this first. Okay, so we've done that. Now what?
that is... haphazardly placed. Let me put that in all center. Center, center, center. Thank you. Alright, let's walk back down here, and... Uh, what the heck, I'll just do this. Why not? Okay, that did exactly what I was hoping it would. Where's the button that controls... Oh yeah, it's up on the side, yeah. It's up there. Oh! I'm making this entirely more complicated than it needs to be. So we push the cube out here, and stop before it goes here, and then we pull it in through here, right? I think, right? Let's try. Okay, so then... We can pull it... ...close to a portal surface, and then... Uh... Well, we can't pull it all the way through, because it'll just fizzle here. So I'm not entirely sure... ...what I'm going for here. Okay, well I messed that up, but I know what to do now. Okay, so here's the problem, right? What is the best way to do this? We basically have to stay up here for quite a while. Also, if nothing ever turns off that, uh, that fizzler... That makes things quite a bit more complicated. That is near a portal surface now. That just goes... ...to show... Hmm, I have a dangerous idea... ...that I'm willing to try. Oh, it doesn't... it doesn't show the, the fizzler thingy through the portal? Come on, game! I guess the fizzler... Uh, shader or whatever that makes it all pretty looking only works when it's on the same actual area as it not through a portal. Oh, I forgot to, uh... Here we go. We lost the, the petty music, but whatever. That was very poorly executed. What even happened? Oh, and it didn't even work! <laughs> Just stops dead. Yeah, there's no way I'm gonna make that trick shot. That's a ninja thing, if anything. Definitely not gonna do it that way. But hey, at least it landed in a convenient spot for me. This button doesn't turn off this fiddler, right? That would be weird if it did. Okay, 
And if we're in here, we really need to have solved the puzzle already. Yeah, because once we fall down here, there's no getting back out. Or no getting back up here anyway. We can walk out, but that's it. Like, there's no portal surfaces up here. And we can't see, we can't get high enough to see any of the higher ones here. That's probably why we're not supposed to be able to recall the cube, without resetting our portals. If we can get the cube down in here, that would also work. Really, up here or down here, it doesn't really matter too much, we just need the cube somewhere. We cannot pull it through this funnel. We need the cube in one of these two places while we're up top. Does the cube auto-respawn? It does! I mean, that would allow us to press the button... ...pretty easily, but then we wouldn't be able to get in here. Exactly what to do. Let's see, so basically, we want to fizzle the cube and then swap it out for the light swap it out with the light bridge. Once we... we do that... And then that. Yes! <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, so... We're done! We did it! We are done!
That is cool, I really like that, that is really clever. Yeah, whatever. Actually, we'll want to give it some time so that we can get on the platform, actually. There we go. And then, all you gotta do... Oops. All you gotta do... ...is spire there. Ta-da! We did it. This is a really good map, I really enjoy this. Awesome work. Well guys, as always, thank you for watching, I really appreciate it, and you can show your appreciation with the two buttons below the video that look like these right here. And I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye!